Right, so as you may have guessed from the title, today I'm doing a look into my Christmas party dresses that I ordered for a size 14. Um, I've gone for like a different range of styles and I will try to put in clips of me trying it on because I've taken them. I had a quick look and try on before filming this because my mum came up to visit and I really wanted to show her and I wanted somebody's second opinion and I was also quite impatient. And I will go through them with you because there are some absolute fails but there's one dress that I really really love and one that would be good if their sizing wasn't iffy. So this is my big bag which I've taken about I don't know 20 awful photos of me with the bag so fun obviously. So first up is this red skater dress it was kind of, it looked more burgundy online and it's come out more red um, but basically it's got this halter neck and then this is where things kind of went downhill because on the pictures online there wasn't this mesh strip here and here it was all fabric and the mesh strip just didn't really suit me and if you look at the back the back is kind of an open mesh thing as well which, yeah, I was kind of disappointed to see it was so different. And it had, although it's a skater dress, um, it's got lots and lots of under layers. So there's all this kind of mesh again, and this layer, and this layer. Um, and it kind of just poofs out. It's very short, and it just makes my butt look massive, which is fine, but I wanted them for kind of a work Christmas do and my butt is basically hanging out of them anyway, which is not fine. Um, <laughs> but yeah, this one, it was a size 14 and it just did not fit. Whereas I, I am a size 14 and some of the other dresses fit. So yeah, I would definitely size up if you like the look of this. I just didn't like the mesh back really. That was kind of my main issue with it because I just, it means I can't wear a bra with it. Although I guess it would depend where this sat really. Um, and if my bra straps were that thin, I just, I don't think I could wear it with a bra. And it's just something that, I've got quite big boobs <laughs> and not wearing a bra is, it has to be a very particular kind of dress for that to work for me. And for me to be willing to go with the boob sweat and the just general chaos of nips everywhere. So that's why that's more of a no. <laughs> and it literally looks nothing like it did online. It didn't have these um, bits of like mesh and it doesn't fit, it doesn't do up even though it's the same size as the other two. And it didn't, the one didn't show the open back and it is way, way too short. My butt will fall out. Um, and it gives me a uni boob. So we're gonna definitely return this. I was really hopeful for this one. So I'm really disappointed, but. So everything that I bought was in the Boohoo 30% off Black Friday sale. That was £24.50, which was the most expensive one I bought, and that was the price in the sale. So next up, we've got this. <laughs> um, which actually, this would have been all right if it wasn't for my body shape. Like the dress in itself, I actually really liked the idea of. So it's, let's see if I can see. It's this spark, very, very sparkly plunge dress. Um, it's kind of, it's fairly short, but it is a dress rather than being a play suit and it's got long sleeves as well. Um, and it basically has large black sequins and small silver sequins all over it. I'm not sure how well you can see the black ones. This is something that I would have to wear without a bra, but it would be the right kind of dress. Um, for me to wear it's just because I'm quite short and quite round and this just didn't really do much for me but I did really like the idea of having a long sleeve dress for this time of year and I think for the right kind of shape person this would be really really lovely. Uh, I just think it just does nothing for me and makes me look dumpier and shorter and wider than I am but I like the sparkles. And that one was, let me just check, that one was 21 pounds in the sale as well. And then 
We have my least favourite of the bunch. I'm really hoping I can put in the bits where I've tried these on because you can see this in all its full anti-glory. Like I'm sure again that this would look lovely on somebody else but it's... I've got a very long body and very short legs and put using... using? Wearing midi dresses kind of gives the risk of me looking very dumpy and frumpy and all the kind of umpy words that you don't want to look like and this again they're all in a size 14 and this was one that didn't fit um which is really frustrating so this is the front of it it's just kind of got a round neck um and it's this almost striped pattern and then you've got a bit where it cinches in at the waist and then it kind of goes out at the bottom into this weird mesh thing um, as I said it is a midi dress and this was this was £17.50 in the sale so this was the cheapest one but I do actually think it looks like in person the material was really lovely and it looks like it's worth a lot more and I could definitely see somebody else wearing it that was more of an appropriate shape um, but where it kind of went I've got kind of a slightly hourglass figure, somewhere between a potato and an hourglass. Um, but my hips do jut out a bit and I've fully got love handles. So where it cinched you in at the waist and then it had this kind of big poofy skirt, it made it look like I had a shelf there, which wasn't the look I was going for. Um, so again, <laughs> this would look really lovely on somebody else, but just not me. This is another definite no. Um, it doesn't fit, it doesn't do up at the back. Um, it, all of the dresses I bought in the same size, so two of them fit and two of them didn't, which is really annoying. And I kind of feel like it makes my hips look massive and it flounces out like I am the bit at the end of the mousetrap board game. And I just hate most things about it. So yeah, this one I'll be returning. And finally, I wanted to save this one till last because it is my winning dress. So this one was £21 in the sale which it is kind of like in the middle of the range for the dresses I bought and I just love it I really wanted something sparkly for Christmas and this in all its sparkly glory is exactly what I needed um, so this is actually the back which I really love the fact that it goes down into this little V um, it kind of has that slightly sexy back and this is the front which it has quite a high neck but it shows off your shoulders a bit because it's quite wide and again I've got um, half sleeves on this basically I, I've posted about it before on here and I will leave a link below to kind of my story and recovery story um, but I have quite bad self-harm scars on my arm and most of them are at the top half of my arm so these kind of sleeves where I'm feeling a bit self-conscious at a work Christmas do are perfect for me really and yeah I just really loved it it's one where it's quite figure hugging um, and it just it comes out a bit uh, it, well it's just designed for kind of more of an hourglass shape so it kind of comes out goes in and then comes out again um, and it comes to kind of like halfway down my thigh which is quite a nice level I think and even though it's sequined it does actually if I can find it it does actually have an under layer so the sequins aren't itchy which is the worst thing when they are so yeah it just feels really soft and it feels really lovely and this is exactly the kind of thing I wanted so this is what I'm going to be wearing to my Christmas do actually makes me look like I've got some shape and the back if you can see that the back is really nice um, and I quite like the neckline on this as well where it kind of shows a bit of shoulder um, and yeah the length is quite nice too so and I like the sparkles so sparkly yes and yeah I hope you really enjoyed that that was my kind of average girl size 14 Christmas party dress haul and hopefully try on um, and kind of a see it so the two sequiny dresses um, were the ones that stayed true to size and yeah I am a size 40 I can be a size 16 but it's usually in bottoms not tops um, and the dresses the two dresses that didn't fit were an issue with my top half 
Um, and one of them I didn't even have a bra on, so it was there wasn't that extra bit of fabric causing an issue. They just didn't fit at all. And I think even a size 16 would have been quite tight. So if you liked either of those, I would definitely size up. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed this. This is my first kind of festive video that I filmed in ages, <laughs> well, over a year. But it's my first festive video of the year, and I really hope you loved it, and I will see you again soon. Bye!